so uh, I've got open the, uh, this is that useless trivia program. And we've asked, you know, we've asked some information. We've done some input. We've done some output. And now let's talk about doing math. Okay, first thing we want to do is create a variable. We're going to do the body mass index calculator. And BMI equals weight in pounds divided by height in inches times height in inches. Okay, then we multiply that by 703. Okay, so we're going to calculate all this in scratch, and then we're going to tell the user what the BMI is. Okay, I'm going to create a variable because I want to calculate BMI. And since this is a simple program that doesn't involve lots of sprites, I'm going to make it for all sprites, for all one of them. All right, so there's BMI. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to set the BMI, and I'm going to set it to that formula. Um, but before I do, uh, just for the sake, I, now in your program, you're going to ask the user how much they weigh and how tall they are. Okay, So you're going to ask them that my, for my purposes. I'm just going to set some values just to, to kind of prepare it. So I'm going to go off of, I'm going to be brutally honest here. I'm going to put myself at 187 because about, that's about where I'm at right now. Oh, that's height. Sorry, weight. Yeah, I'm 187 inches tall. That would be pretty cool. Okay, so I set weight, 187. So I'm, now I'm going to set height. So, of course, obviously you got to set all these values. Now, normally, you would just set uh, weight to the answer to the question, right, like you did up here. So just remember that this is just for our testing purposes only. So I'm going to put height on here. And now the height. I'm 70. Okay, I'll be honest. I actually lost an inch since high school. So sad. Could be my... I don't know. It could be uh, just gravity, I guess, over the years. All right, so we set weight. We set the height. Now, if I click on this, you'll note it'll say height 71. If I click on weight, it'll say what the weight is up at the top. Now, if you want to hide those variables, you just click them and they'll go away. It's like I don't need to see name anymore, so I'm going to hide it. For testing purposes, I'm going to just, just go ahead and um, plug them, you know, put them up here in order, height, weight, BMI. Okay, so what we need to do now is calculate the BMI. So let's look at the formula and make sure we've got this done correctly. So we're gonna take, uh, notice the parentheses, okay? You always do the innermost parentheses first and then you work your way out. Now, Scratch is designed in math to actually do that very thing. But we're gonna need the variables height and weight and we're gonna need to represent height two times, weight once. So I'm going to go back to scratch, and I'm going to take height, click on it, and just drag it out. And I'm going to get weight, and I'm going to drag it out. Did I say weight is two times and height is height is twice? Uh, if you want a second one, you can just right-click and duplicate. So now we've got all of our variables we need for the formula. So now we're going to go to the operators. That's green. And notice you can only perform one operation at a time but you can build them out. As I recall, there was a height times a height. So we just drag a height and drop it in one window, drag the other height, drop it in the other, make sure it's the time sign. So we've got that. Okay, then what else do we need to do? Let's go back to the formula. So we've covered these parentheses. We need to do these. So we need to take weight in pounds and divide it by the answer to that. So we just chain them all together. So it's divide by. So we just drag that out. Now, if you right-click on it, look at this. We can change it to plus. We can change it. Oops, hold on. We can change it to minus. We're going to change it here. Okay. So now I'm going to take the weight on the left, and we're going to divide the weight by height times height. And then finally, we need to add. No, was it add? Multiply. Multiply by 703. So drag another one out. And we drag all of this into the first dot, and then we put 703 here. Now, my BMI is, should be 25. It, well, actually, it should be 24, but it's in actuality, it is 25. Uh, so what we're going to do is just drag all this out and test it. Now, see how this works? Set BMI to, and then we just calculate it all out using the appropriate, um, 
the appropriate operators. And you can right click in any one of these and switch to another one if you didn't do it correctly. Now I'm going to click on here, BMI says 26. Did I do that right? That, oh, it's because I changed my height. I lied in my last class. I said I was 72. But then I remember just now that my doctor said I'm really 70, 71 inches high. So now my BMI is going up. Now I need to really hit the trail, uh, get on my bike, run some more. So now I have no excuse. All right, but there you have the formula. And then another thing I want to point out is uh, another set of operators. Uh, you, by the way, you can round the answer. So notice BMI there says 26.1. If I drag all of this, oops, if I drag all of it, I'll drag it here to round. I can round it off. Oh, wait, I'm just going to click it here. And now the BMI is just an integer. Okay. Uh, I'm going to take that out, though. I, I don't mind the exact number. I'm just going to delete that. So, the last thing here I want to point out is you can get the square root of numbers, you can get the absolute value, sine, cosine, tangent, etc. So you got a lot of these here. Okay, so you have other mathematical formulas that you can add, and the rest you're just going to have to do with your operators. Uh, I should point out the join letter length. These all have to do with strings, not actually with numbers. So be careful trying to get the letter one of a number. I don't know if that will work or not. That would be interesting to find out. Let's see if it lets me. <laughs> it did. Letter one. Okay, well, apparently it treats numbers as strings or, yeah, when you use this particular one. <laughs>